Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and uh, we are seeing the software cost estimation factors. This is the part two of the software cost estimation factors. So we have, in the previous video, we have covered about the programmer ability and also the product complexity. In this video, we will cover the next other factors. So the, the third one, I like the programmer ability, the first factor, the product size, the size of the product, the size of the software is also plays a major role in estimating the, estimating the software cost. So a large software product is more expensive to develop than a small one. That is the, um, uh, that is the universal truth. If you have a larger, larger product means it is more expensive to develop. So you will have, uh, uh, if the product size increases, that is it depends upon the number of clients, the number of programmers were there, the number of programs will increase, the number of uh, programming lines, lines will also increase. Like one, one said that, and uh, uh, the rate of increase in required effort grows with the number of source instruction at an exponential. So if the rate of increase in a requirement, required effort grows, the number of source instruction at an exponential. So what he says that, if you have a large software product, automatically the number of programmers will increase and also the source instruction code will also increase. So these are all uh, some of the equations which has been uh, developed by R for your reference and uh, PM for programmer mind and KDSI for uh, uh, the number of lines, the number of source code lines. And uh, the next factor that influence the software cost estimation is the available time. So if you want your product to be uh, if you want to increase the productivity of the software, if you want to increase the quality of the software, then you must finish the uh, 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 product within the uh, estimated time, or you can say within the estimated time. As a software engineering uh, definition says that uh, at, the, at the particular time or at the given time, uh, in do, within the cost estimates. So, so the available time, we must make a look at it and uh, we must uh, frame a development schedule. We must have a milestones also. That is the most important thing. And uh, the next factor that influences the software cost estimation is the required reliability. So we have already seen about the programmer's ability, the individual ability. Now we are seeing the required reliability. So the reliability is expressed in four main terms, the accuracy, the robustness, and the completeness, and the consistency. So these are the uh, four major factors or more uh, terms in which the reliability of the software is <coughs> what you call as, which is delivered. The next factor that influence the software cost estimation is the level of technology. So the technology goes day by day, everything is updated day by day. Now we have the artificial intelligence, you have the machine learning, so and so. <clears throat> so we must adapt to the level of technology which is being there at the time. So it will cost you more. And the another thing is the program has to learn, uh, depends upon the requirement. And um, you must learn, uh, for example, uh, uh, yes, software project is mainly reflected. The software project is mainly reflected by a programming language, the abstract machine the program like the software tools you. So if you are using last year, if you have developed a software and you have used a different tools in this year, you have to use different software tools. So the programmer ability plays a major role here. The programmer must be able to adapt to the technology. 